Selena be alive? Where is Johnson getting his information from? You should tell your crush. I'm not telling Kyle yet. I'm sorry, what? Mom, I thought you said you were gonna talk to Dad. I was, honey, but- Our daughter has feelings for our arch enemy's brother. <laughs> Emma, you like Kyle? Yeah. Can you girls give us some alone time? Jane, you stay here. This involves you too. When were you planning on telling me about this? Soon, but look, that's not what's important right now. Yeah, first things first, what makes you think that this chick is still alive? I mean, I think you two are forgetting the part where I shot her. She wouldn't be our first enemy that's risen from the dead. And Director Johnson sent us this. You're a tongue. Guys, you don't know this is her. We literally live in a world where there's cyber disguises and deep fakes. True. It could be someone just trying to mess with us. But that's not a chance we're willing to take. Director Johnson has found the location where the video was sent from. And we were wondering if maybe you could... You want to know if I can babysit so you two can go on your little spy adventure? Actually, we were going to ask you to come with us. Look, as much as I hate to admit it, we do make a pretty good team. And if Selena is actually alive... We're going to need all the backup we can get. Wait, so who's going to watch the kids? Well... well... Victoria? Hey, sis. Long time no see. Hi, Victoria. Hi, Maya. Hi, John. You're looking... nice. Uh, thanks. John always looks nice. Would you two stop looking at him like that? <laughs> Maya, how does it feel knowing John's kissed all three of us? Victoria, we used to date. And my kiss with Jane was unintentional. I don't know, it felt pretty intentional to me. You were impersonating Maya. I thought you were my wife. I thought we were gonna show Aunt Victoria the new baby. Emma, you're right, sweetheart. Everyone, follow me. Wow, Maya, your kids are adorable. But four of them? Mm, you and John must really love having- Okay, I think it's time for us to go. You think you can handle the kids? If I can handle my devil child, Lexi, I think I can handle your four little angels. I'd hardly call Sarah an angel. Hey! Girls. Promise us you'll behave while we're gone. Okay, okay we, we will. will. All right, come here. Give me a big hug. We won't be long, okay? You behave. <laughs> Babe, how are you holding up? I'm fine. Which is code for she's panicking. Is not. I'm not going to worry about the kids because I know that they're safe. Exactly. We installed baby cams everywhere, so if anything happens, we'll see it. Hey, I think I see our destination. You ready to jump? Jump? No, nobody said anything about jumping. Whoops, did we forget to mention that? Don't worry, you'll be parachuting with me. Hell no, I have a horrible fear of heights. Jane, we have to jump. I'll do it if John parachutes with me. Jane, just come with me. I want John. Fine, you are unbelievable. You did really well, Jane. Really? Because I feel like I'm gonna... Okay, according to my new and improved tracking necklace, courtesy of Director Johnson, it looks like we're on site. It shows the video was sent a couple blocks down from here, so we're about to find out if Selena is still alive. Alright, I'll let Johnson know we're on site. Our backup is on standby. I'm gonna go check the perimeter. Jane, you watch the van. Copy that. Hello, Maya. Oh. Jane? Hey, where's the van? Gone, and so is Jane. How is that possible? I don't know. I left her alone for like five minutes. She probably stole the van. Why would she do that? Because she's Jane. She's a con woman. It's what she does. She's been living with us for months. If she wanted to steal our van, Hang she would have- Hang on, John. Do you see that? We never walked that way. Time to wake up. Where am I? I just have a few questions to ask you, Maya. Then I'll let you go. Somehow I have a really hard time believing that. And did you just call me Maya? That's right. I know you are the famous Agent 22. No, not this again. Listen, buddy, I'm not Maya. I see you want to play games. We never walked that way. Someone else was here. Listen, I swear to you, I'm not Maya. I'm her twin. I see you don't want to tell the truth. Well, I have something that can fix that. Try to stay very still. You'll only feel a pinch. Ugh. You might be feeling a little bit funny right now. <laughs> How about we try this again? I just have one question for you. What was that? 
truth serum. Oh no, Maya warned me about this stuff. Enough. I want to know about your involvement with the Red Ghost. The what? Sir, there's a phone call for you. Can't you see I'm busy? It's your wife, sir. She says it's urgent. Oh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna get you out of here, but we need to hurry. Why do you look so familiar? We never met Maya. My name's Ben. I'm not Maya. It's okay. You don't have to pretend around me. I'm with the good guys. I just got off the phone with Director Johnson. He says he's on his way, but I could have sworn I heard the kids in the background. Anyways, it's a good thing we put a tracker on Jane. Yeah. And it shows she's right. There. Let her go. Benny? Johnny? You two know each other? Yeah, we're cousins. How are there two of you? We're twins, genius. Why do you have Jane? I thought she was you. I was saving her. Ben, I thought you worked in construction. And I thought you were an appraiser. <laughs> you guys are too funny. Um, what's up with her? Truth serum. Hey, who's that? Guys, we got company. Okay, John and I will handle this, and Ben, you can... Handle Jane and get her somewhere safe, okay? Maya. You called? You thought you could escape. Why do you look different? You're not very bright, are you? Oh. Now, John. Oh. What is that? Let me give you a demonstration. Oh. Oh. So you're telling me you're a double agent? I was working with this guy so I could gather intel on him and report back to my boss. So who's your boss? That's confidential. We don't have time for confidentiality. I want to know who your boss is now. Damn, John, you weren't kidding when you told me she was feisty. You told him about me? Yeah. When you two were dating, he couldn't stop talking about you. Then we lost contact for a while. So are you two engaged now? Actually, we're- No, don't tell him anything. If he won't talk, neither will we. Guys, I'm on your side. How do we really know that? Exactly. Oh, would you two shut up? I say we trust the man. Thank you. Ben, I want to trust you. But first, we need to know more about what you're doing here. <sighs> She calls herself the Red Ghost. I'm sorry? My boss. That's her code name. I've never actually seen her face. And the man that was after you, he's been searching for my boss. So then, uh, why come after me? He believed you had a connection to her. He says she owes him money. It's Selena. What? His boss. It's definitely Selena. Who's Selena? Ben, just answer me this. How long have you been working for your boss? About a few months now. Where did you find her? Why is that important? Answer the question. The dark web. I needed the money. How much was she paying you? A lot. Blondes always pay more, don't they? I wouldn't consider her hair blonde. I thought you said you've never seen her face. Rookie mistake, Ben. Whoa! Guys, I can explain. Where is she? This isn't a game. I'm sorry. She tricked me. What are you talking about? She told me this was going to be a rescue mission. That I was going to save Maya. But now... Now what? She's here. Surprise, surprise. No way in hell. What's the matter, Maya? You look like you've seen a ghost. Don't move a step closer. Don't worry, John. I'm not gonna do anything. But there's some men that paid an awful lot of money for all of you. What are you talking about? This wasn't part of the deal. Deals change. <laughs> Here's your money, as promised. We'll take it from here. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> John? Your husband is going to be asleep for a little while, just like the others. What did you do to them? Don't worry about them. We're focusing on you. <sighs> Look at me. Don't you remember me, Maya? Oh. Package is secured. Secure. You, you were my first target. Actually, it was my son. He looked just like me. You killed him. Your son was a threat. He was responsible for killing three Interpol agents. I was given the job to eliminate him. I'm sorry. Don't lie to me. <sighs> You're not sorry. You know, a little birdie told me you recently had a child. <sighs> Babies are so precious, aren't they? It'd be a shame if something happened to yours. You stay away from my baby. <sighs> I'll be right back. How do you know Selena? Where is she? Like I'm gonna tell you anything. Do me a favor and keep quiet. Uh, Maya? John, you're awake. What happened? Did they hurt you? I'm okay, but we have to get out of here. I think I can help with that. Sarah? What are you doing here?
I was the only one small enough to fit in this vent. Is that a laser in your hands? Yep. Uh. You're a real lifesaver, sweetheart. Dr. Johnson says for me to come back now. Yes, Sarah, go back. It's not safe here. And be careful. I will, I will. How did you get free? Is this the guy who hurt you, babe? Yeah, that's him. Well, allow me to introduce myself, sir. Ben, Jane, are you guys all right? Oh, hey, guys. We were just, uh... And you said John and I were bad. Look, both of us got free. Then we got to talking. And we kind of figured we were going to die in this place, so... So you decided to have a makeout session, even though he betrayed us? No. I think I hear our team. It's about time backup arrived. Let's go! And Emma's here too. Guys, what is going on? Um, well... <sighs> you two were worried about me, so you decided to contact Director Johnson. And we devised a little plan to rescue you. You were tracking my necklace, weren't you? Yeah. And the babies are still home with Victoria? Yeah, I'm checking the nanny cams right now. They're with her. Are we just gonna ignore the fact that we saw Selena alive? We don't even know if that was really her. It wasn't. I just got confirmation. We have Selena's body. I knew it. Then who is this person posing as Selena? AKA the Red Ghost. <laughs> girls, go with your father now. John, girls, come with me. John, get them the hell out of here. But Maya, they can handle this. I've got her back, John. So do I. Mom, Aunt Jane, be careful. We will. So, you're a copycat. You think you're tough pretending to be someone else? Who says I'm pretending? Enough with the mind games. We know you aren't Selena. If I'm not her, then how do you explain this? That's where I shot you. It's fake. She's lying. I saw her die. You really think I wouldn't be smart enough to fake my own death? Johnson got some faulty intel. Tell me you guys just saw that. Did her face just glitch? What are you doing? Putting an end to your game. No! It was a cyber mask. I knew it. And a voice manipulator? Who are you? Someone who cared about Selena a lot. It doesn't matter who she is. She's under arrest. This conversation doesn't involve you, Ben. You shouldn't have betrayed me. Ben! Please tell me you're wearing the vest. Yeah. Still hurts like hell, though. You're gonna be okay. Just rest here, and I'm gonna go kick that chick's ass. Get back, now. Why are you smiling? Because I only had one bullet left, and you used it on Ben. Yeah, about that. <sighs> ah, nice one. I can tell you've been practicing. Oh, I'm only gonna ask you this once. Why are you doing this? You don't scare- Ugh, Fine. I was Selena's failsafe. If anything were to happen to her, I was supposed to finish the job. What job? She told me to make sure that I ruined both of your lives. Selena already put my family in danger. She almost killed me. She took our mom from us before I even got the chance to meet her. What more could she want? <laughs> so much more. You're insane. Jane, help me detain her. No, Maya, that won't be happening. You see, I've already set things into motion. You have no idea what's coming to you. Guys, we need to run, now! What? What's going on? This whole place is rigged with explosives! And I have the detonator. <laughs> Part of me hopes you'll survive this, Maya, because what will happen next will be so interesting. We gotta go now. I'll be with you soon, Selena. My job here is done. Five, Five four, four, three, Maya, come on! two, two one. one. You guys sure you're okay? Yeah, we're a little banged up, but we're okay. We barely made it out of there. I'm just glad that psycho chick is dead. Her name was Alana. How do you know that? Director Johnson did some digging, and it turns out Selena had a sister. Okay, well I guess that explains why she was willing to die for her. And Ben, it looks like Director Johnson wants to see you for questioning. I kind of figured. Call me when you're done? Will do. Wish me luck. I have a feeling he's not going to be too happy with me. Hey Maya, your second phone's been blowing up over there for the past few minutes. You might want to go check it. Mm. I told Victoria not to call me on... this phone. You want to tell me why you sent two bodyguards over to watch the kids? Call me back! Bodyguards? Maya, I need confirmation that these guys were sent- What happened? Something is wrong. We need to get back home now. Oh my god. Victoria, what happened? Where's the babies? They took them. What? 
I tried to stop them, but there were too many. Too many what? Men? Yeah, but I have their location. I put a tracker on one of them. How long have they been gone? About 30 minutes. Did you call the police? <sighs> no. I'm not sure if you noticed, Maya, but I'm currently bleeding out as we speak. Maya, I'll get Victoria to a hospital. You go save the kids. What's the location? It's... it's Adrian's old warehouse. Hey, you gonna be okay to go? Yeah, John's gonna meet me there. He's on his way. Victoria, just breathe. I'm gonna call the police right now. Put the phone down! What? Why? Because this blood is fake. I'm fine. And so are the kids. I don't understand. If the kids are here and you're fine, where the hell are Maya and John going? I'm sorry. Victoria, what is going on? It was either them or me. Lexi? I had to pick my daughter. Who made you pick? She called herself the Red Ghost. Hey kid, hold your cousin for me. Uh, okay. Stay here with the kids, I'm going after them. No, I promised not to intervene. Well, I didn't. Jane, you don't understand. It's too late. There's nothing we can do. Don't say that. You know damn well we can save them. Aaliyah? AJ? Where are you? These are my babies. Please. Maya, don't cry. Everything's okay. Adrian? Hello, Maya. I've missed you. Don't worry. Your babies aren't actually in danger. You see, Maya, before I died, I was able to download my consciousness and convert it into sort of a AI version of myself. What? I know we don't like Maya very much, but she's still our sister. So unless you want to be responsible for making her four children orphans, you suit up and come with me or get out of my way. Initiating lockdown. Now that I have you here, Maya, I can't let you go. No, no, I'm calling John. Maya, put the phone down. You were supposed to have been with me. Smash it. That's a good girl. No. You want to listen to me. Shut up. I'm gonna shoot the screen. No, you're not. Put the gun down. I said put it down. <sighs> I'm gonna play a special video for you now. No, this can't be happening. You must comply. John! There's no sense in fighting this, Maya. It's time for you to remember. You and I are together. No, stop. You need to remember us. John's a criminal. Good girl. Good. And who am I? You're my boyfriend. You loved me. Shut up, Maya. Put your head on my shoulder. I'm so happy for us. We had such fun together. Don't you remember now, Maya? That's it. Just relax. And look up at the screen. You will comply and listen to everything that is told to you. John is no longer your husband. He is your enemy. You're either going to suit up and come with me, or get the hell out of my way. Damn it, Jane. Why'd you have to choose now to grow a conscience? I knew you had a soft spot for her, too. Yeah, yeah. Just get everyone loaded in the car before I change my mind. Are you sure this is the place? Positive. Adrian and I used to come here to... To do what, Mom? Nothing. Never mind. Look, Jane, Lexi and I will watch the kids. But if you're not back in at least 15 uh, minutes... You'll have no choice but to leave without me. Yeah, I figured. Oh, yeah! This whole thing was a trap. The kids are safe. I know. You have that look in your eye. You sure you're alright? Never better, babe. <laughs> I should have done this years ago. Wait! Think of the kids! Something is controlling you! You need to fight it! John! What have you done? I have to finish the job. What is with all the men I like getting shot today? You have to stop her. She's been mind-controlled. She's armed and highly dangerous. I need to send a team after her. No. If she tries to shoot at them, they will kill her. Get John to a hospital. I've got this. Wait! Show her this. Maya? What are you wearing? A dress Adrian saved for me in his warehouse before he died. Isn't it cute? He really does have her in a trance. You shouldn't have followed me here. You got in the way of my plans, and that means now you have to die. 
Okay, calm down, Miss Supervillain. I'm actually here to help you kill John. Now, why would you do that? After all, don't you love him? Well, his cousin Ben and I are kind of a thing now, so... <clears throat> gotcha. Who's the faster twin now? Sorry, Maya. That was my favorite gun. Well, you're not really yourself right now, and I'm not gonna let you kill me with that. I don't need a gun to kill you. Maya, hey, I can't fight you. Good, then this will be easy. Aw, that looks like it hurt. Oh, come on, that wasn't even that hard. Get up. I said get up. <sighs> you know I just had a baby. Kind of why I did it. <clears throat> Any last words, Jane? Necklace. <laughs> Are you trying to show me that stupid little necklace John gave me? Go ahead and show it to me, Jane, because I want to show it to John after I kill you, and right before I murder him. <sighs> Poor little Jane. You really think this necklace is gonna make me... As long as you're wearing it, he'll yes. always be with you. Babe, what is this? Don't worry, it's not a ring. It's just something to remember me by, since we both work long distance. As long as you're wearing it, I'll always be with you. What are you doing? Making a bed. Maya, don't sleep on the floor. Oh no, this is for you. You're a criminal, John. A dirty, rotten, no good. Why are you looking at me like that? You're just really uh, cute when you're mad. You're delusional. And you're in love with me. You wish. Then why are you still wearing the necklace? Maybe I just think it's pretty. Not as pretty as you. I now pronounce them husband and wife. What did I do? It's gonna be okay. She snapped out of it. Send help. Agent 22, can you hear me? I apologize for the restraints, they're just a precaution. Jane, my husband, are, are they okay? We cannot give you any details. We need to confirm that you are back to yourself, so you will be taking a lie detector test. Final question, do you wish to harm anyone in your family? No. Alright, she passed. Set her free and send her to Director Johnson, please. Yes, ma'am. I could have killed him and Jane. But you didn't! I should have been stronger. I... I should have stopped myself. Your love for John is obviously very strong. It broke you out of that trance. Do you think you can take me to go see him? Of course. Maya? I am so sorry. I... I try to stop myself, but I couldn't. And... I just need to know if you can forgive me. Does that answer your question? Let me know if this hurts. Yeah, a little bit. And how about this? Mm, yeah. I'm gonna go get you something to help with the pain. Excuse me, Miss Danvers? What? There's a Ben here to see you? Send him in. I hear you're kind of a hero. Nah, I'm definitely more of the villain type. Oh, are you now? Yeah, let's just say I've had my fair share of jail time. I actually have a tracker in my wrist. It was the only way Director Johnson would let me go free. That doesn't bother you, does it? Not at all. Especially since I have the same thing. You're kidding. No, I actually don't have a very clean record myself. It was either get the tracker implant or go to an underground prison, so I went with the first option. He really only needs one of these to keep track of us. Why is that? Because wherever you are, that's where I'll be. Are you sure you're okay, Dad? I'm alright. This isn't the first time I've been shot. Girls, I'm so sorry. I know I promised us a normal life, but... It's okay, Mom. Being normal is so overrated. Besides, we like all of the action. I don't think we could have asked for better kids. I'm so proud of all of you. And Emma, if you want to date Kyle, it's fine by me. Really, Dad? We trust you. Thanks, I love you guys. What are you doing? <laughs> hey, AJ, you wanna go watch Coco Melon? Come on, let's go put it on.
What is all this? You didn't think I'd forget about our anniversary, did you? I just figured with everything that happened, we wouldn't... Celebrate? Babe, if anything, these events have made me realize how precious time is. I'm scared, John. What if Adrian gets in my head again? And this time... Hey, look at me. That's not gonna happen. But what if it does? Then we'll deal with it together. You'll have my back, right? Always. Yes, it's true, I'm falling hard for you. But I won't rush this love. I can wait even if it's hard to take. One moment is enough. I will be standing here right by your side. I just can't believe that Adrian is Lexi's father. I can't believe you never told us. It's not something I'm proud of. Does Lexi know about this? No. So if either of you say anything about this to her, I will kill you. Whoa. Yeah, love you too. So, you're moving in with Ben, huh? Yeah. Well, we're gonna miss you, and if you need anything, don't do that. Do what? <laughs> Be all sweet to me. I know you still feel bad about hurting me, but I told you I am fine. I know you say that, but... Hey, I let you get tortured, remember? We're even. I guess. I know Victoria's secret. And girl, you wouldn't believe. She slept with your stalker and had a little baby named Lexi. I'm done singing now. Too soon? I thought it was funny.